All right, welcome back. This is Gunny Boy. We are playing Resident Evil. We are now into. We're gonna head back. I went ahead and I saved it. I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna put the other ammo disc in there, and yeah, I'll leave those there. I'm going to put the other MO disc in. Can't get in that door yet. Come on. And then uh, I think what I'll do is I need to go into the other... Stay down. Good. Stay there! Alright, we're gonna hop in here real quick. Probably has another MO disc as well. Um Yeah, we're gonna hop in. Oh, actually, I think we already went in here, didn't we? Well, oh, wait, no, I did that one. But it's not. Uh, uh, let's go check out the other uh, thing. I'm trying to get a bearing on exactly where I left off. I think it was... Uh, I think. I'm just going to drop the other envelope disc off so while I'm at it. I might as well. Was there? No, I wasn't in here. But I do need to be in here for something. Because I haven't picked everything up. Alright, you can almost you've never seen before. Divers are frozen, wrapped in body bags. So, I know I need to get on here. Oops. I do remember the password, though. Denied. Try enter password. This is unlocked, and that's the actually that's the room that I was in earlier. So B two is the other. It's that's the room on the second floor. There's the door lock off. Okay. Yeah. So the factor is finding the the password for the B two door, which is the basement. Two door. Let's 
so we're going to go this way. Let me go in here. Alright, is it this one? I think it is. I think it's this door. Something scrawled on the notepad to use the electronic door. Place the initials. Place the initials in alphabetical order. Okay, well they're in alphabetical order, but logically, there's no real way to know exactly what. There's no. There's no real way to know what the password is. So I had to do some digging and to find out what exactly the password was. And apparently it's supposed to be basically the, you have the names in alphabetical order, but each picture is supposed to, or each x-ray is supposed to depict a different, a different section of the body. And there's no way to, for you to actually know these things until, uh, well, there's, there's no way for you to actually know, know what it is. And I'll, sh I'll show you what the password is to unlock that door because um, I would not have figured it out and because there's no dictation unless it's in something that I, in one of the notes that I read that would have dictated and said oh no this is what this this is what the the password is going to be as it's going to be you know this in the picture it's going to be Label. This is not the the place that I wanted to be at. Oh, it is the place I wanted to be at. I went too far back. So, so there's no, there was no way for me to actually know. And, and people may have thought about this differently, but the password for this is going to be. There's no way that that I would have figured that one out on my own. So that's B2. I know where B2 is. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and cancel this. Yes. So we're done in this room. So it should be green. That's not. It's not green. Why is it not green? There's probably something else that's going on in here. Okay, well, I, I, I don't know where everything is in that freaking room. Because I can't see everything. So, what we're going to do now is we're going to go ahead and go this way. We're going to go up to B2. Since and I didn't put the ammo, uh, yeah, I didn't put the ammo disc in. Let me do that real quick, because yeah, I don't, feel like, 
I don't feel like dragging that thing around everywhere and I really don't need it. I think it's in this room? I think it's in here. 99% sure it's in here. So we're gonna go to. Oh wait, no, it's not in this room. It's in. Where's the security room? It's a small, small room. How do we get here? Is it? I guess it could be. I guess I can pick that up. I guess I'll pick that up. Sure, why not? I mean, yeah. Whatever. Alright, well, well I th yeah, actually, I think it is in here. What? Stab in the eyeball! Place the MO disc. Uh, yes, it is. Frickin okay. okay, it seems to have unlocked something. Well, So it, it says it, it, it unlocks something, but it. Uh. Uh, I guess I am dragging it around with me. Freaking. Just gonna swell. I guess I'm going up past, up around the, uh... I suppose I could. Just drop it, drop this stuff off. It's just a irritating fact that I can't just stick the ammo disc in there, but whatever. I'll deal with that later. I don't even know what this is for. Slide filter. So, we're going to go ahead and, uh, alright, so we're going to go into B2, we're going to figure out, hopefully I don't have to go back and forth 50 million times. What is this? Another ammo disc. I got three now. Okay, so. Security protocols. Hel he heliport. 
for executive use only. This restriction does not apply in the event of an emergency. Passage to the heliport entry is prohibited unless accompanied by a consultant researcher of the Chiefs of Security. Unauthorized persons entering the heliport will be shot on site. Elevator. The elevator stops during emergencies. Visual data room. For use by the Special Research Division only, all other access to the visual data room must be cleared with Keith Arving, room manager. Prison. Sanitation Division. Controls the use of the prison. At least one consultant researcher, E. Smith, S. Ross, A. Wesker, must be present if viral use is authorized. Triple lock door. Entry in a room is limited to the sole person of who deactivates the lock with all the passcodes. Accessing the exclusive output terminals located in each section of the senior researcher's deactivates lock. Each section of the senior researcher's each section of the, res of the senior researcher's deactivates lock. Okay, power room. In this room, nitro compound is used as the primary fuel source of power. Ooh, exclusive. Access is limited to headquarters supervisors. This restriction may not apply to consultant researchers with special authorization. Passcode output terminals. Use and access to output terminals is limited to authorized senior researchers. Regarding the progress of Tyrant after the administration of T-Virus. Illegitimate hereafter. Sure, I'll take those. Really? Really? MA-39, Cerberus. Neptune, FIO-3. MA-121, Hunter. Big boys. Tyrant, T O O two. Really don't want to have that's interesting. Coming in here was practically useless. Well, not useless. I was able to get this. Excuse me, a box of shotgun shells. So one thing I do need to do So I'm not picking anything else up. We're gonna go ahead and uh, do this one real quick. Okay. 
so one thing we're gonna do first is we're going to Eight, four, six, two. Okay, well that works. All right, so eight, four, six, two. That's got to be the code for yeah. Eight. Yep. Oh, you. Yes. Eight, four, six, two. Beep. Is that what was over here? Laboratory key. Yes. We're gonna go down, back down to the, to the security office, and we're gonna try these MO discs again because I want to. And now that I have a labor laboratory key, I can now go through and say, "Hmm, well, let's take a look in this laboratory here and see what else is going on." First, I need to get rid of these ammo discs in my... And I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure that it's supposed to go into... Well, this one. And I guess I could pull the disc out, maybe? Well, no, because it would have given me that option to, of going into. If I already clicked on it, transmitting passcode seems to have unlocked something. Okay. Uh, so. So... There's gotta be a way to, like, pull the, pull the disc out. Because it unlocked the thing, so in theory I should be able to... I've already pulled the thing down, so... Was like not supposed to pull it down? Okay, well. Anyways. 
let's go and let's go into the laboratory because apparently it's let's see here. Yeah, let's go to the laboratory and see if that's Okay, there's, so there's three of them. Alright, so let's see here. Oh, B3, okay. It's in here. Figures. The frick is he? What am I supposed to do in here? Oh. Bugger. Ah. Oh, I do have an MO disc. I w wish you would quit asking me that. So we're out of that. All right. So we're, I guess we're done in there. We're gonna, we're gonna go into uh, this card. Yeah, let's get rid of it. I don't need it. Okay, so that's the room I was in. The elevators are not going to work, so there's no point in trying the elevators. Oh, I can I can go in here. I prop. Oh, it's a save point. Wonderful. Yeah, grenade shows. 
probably need that. Yeah, let's use the first aid spray. We're gonna save it, we're gonna take a break. Let's see here. Da, 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 da. Boy, Joe. Now I got more, more grenades. Yay. I might actually go through and let me put this back. Wait, let me swap it out here real quick. I like grenades. I like grenades. I like grenades. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to take a break. When we come back, we're going to get to the last um, point, which is going to be... We're going to turn left. And uh, the last ammo disc, the, that it needs to be used somewhere down there. At least that's from what I was... What I have read. So if you like what you see, hit that like button. If you, if you want to see more, hit that bell get notified every time I get every time I upload a new video which is pretty much every day except Sundays I do I will be starting my lives back up on the weekends and I will see you guys in the next video and until then bye